making it rain, ghost face, making it rain. Hello, my sexy muffins, and welcome back to another video. In this video, obviously, Ghostface is obviously making it rain. But we are also going to be doing Ghostface as a yonder. I chose Dead by Daylight one because he is my favorite. And we are going to be doing him. Okay, I hope that you all enjoy. And yes, let's us do this. Do 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 do. Pull it in my notes. Pull it in my notes. Pull it in my notes. Okay, here we go. Disclaimer, so far in canon, Ghostface from Dead by Daylight is not Yandere. This was just for fun, a what if, if you will, simping and liking fictional Yandere characters and killers that are fiction is fine, but please separate fiction from reality and Yandere's and killers are not ideal partners to have. Do not simp over real life serial characters, please. And yeah, let's do this. <laughs> this guy loves attention. He likes people reading about him, learning more about him, and being the center of attention. This rolls over to his love for you. He needs to be your one and only and soul focused. He needs to know that he is the one, only one for you and you are the only one for him. He also is a pervert and would hit on you nonstop. Flirting with you, checking out your ass. He would have a thing for taking pictures and videos of you. He's the type of yarnery that would have a darling wall. In which the whole wall, or walls, is covered with your face and pictures of you all over it. From ones you allowed him to take of you to the more extreme ones of you sleeping or changing your clothes or even bathing. He would love the days that he gets to see you and he would do never let and you escape. Blech, that was a tongue twister. Playing a game account of cat and mouse where he chases you and drags you in it and drags it out for hours on end. Loves to tease you, make you flustered and snap at him, makes his day. He gets your the attention he wants and he gets to make you flustered. What more could he want? He would deal with his rivals by stabbing them. He is a yandere of passion and would snap a lot and snap and stab a lot of rivals repeatedly at least thirty times each. He then would cut off their family jewels. And, or stab their family jewel, Lady Bits, to make it clear that they fricked with the wrong man. And end them by slashing their throats. He would proceed to hunt you down and make love to you. Or just make out with you if you're not ready for going to the fourth base. He is not the one to force sex on you. He confesses to you by teasing you and then went, what did what the then that is not enough just screams at you that he is in love with you if you accept his love great if you don't well that's the type he is the type that is going to kidnap you and chain you to the bed hell he even may think that having tur you turned him down was the best thing in his life because now you are stuck with him chained to his bed and you can do nothing to keep him out of your life it is his dream come true he has all the time in the world, thanks to the Antony to woohoo and make you his. Besides, making you love him is half the fun. Anyways, I hope that you all enjoyed that. If you would like to see more Dead by Daylight characters, comment them below. Maybe I'll do a Dead by Daylight, Daylight Hunger Games. Who knows? I hope that you all enjoyed and stay sexy on my sexy muffins. Bye-bye!